What's going on everybody? This is 40B Nasty. I'm here to show you an update with my tank. It is all about my new tank mate, not the algae in my tank for once, which is a great thing because it's been looking really good for the past six months. And it is this gorgeous red line wrasse. It is a male um, Helichorus biosalatus. I believe that's the uh, Latin name for it. It is not a Christmas wrasse. As you can see when he turns, you see those gold stripes right there? That is a great indicator during the juvenile males. He's already lost his spots. Um, that this is definitely a red line. I was actually sold this as a Christmas wrasse. And that is the Helichorus ornatissimus. And there is also a Helichorus claudia, which is the ornate. And they, all these three wrasses look pretty similar as juveniles, even as adults. But this is definitely the red line, and I'm very happy with this purchase. He has been eating like a pig. Even at the store, he was eating. When I brought him home after an hour and a half ride, he was eating. Even being in the 1.018 um, specific gravity, I had to bring him up to my tank, which is 1.025. So it took about three hours, almost four hours, and it's about seven gallons of water just to bring him up. These two have been little buddies, and that's awesome. I love Pinky. He's such a good tank mate. He always welcomes everybody in. And um, the only one that's really been kind of bullying him is the Flame Angel. But it's going to do a quick short video on this guy and how he's been doing. But he is definitely eating like a champ. And I hopefully I can keep Garfield out of his hair, which is my Flame Angel. As you can see, he's doing a little bit of flashing. I'm kind of worried that he might have flukes, but I don't know. He's been keeping my, leaving my bumblebee snails alone, which is good because I'm trying to get rid of these fermented snails that are in my tank. Hopefully he keeps away from them. But this is 40B Nasty out. Take care. Thanks for watching.